All right, we all know that One UI 4.0 or Android 12 on Samsung phones allows us to customize the theme through color palettes or the GoodLock application, which is of course the theme park engine. Uh, we can completely customize the themes on the phone. We can even customize the notification panel on GoodLock. Now the question is, how do we customize or set a particular color for this brightness bar over here? As you can see, uh, these uh, switches are in different color and we have got this brightness bar in a different color and we can actually customize and set a particular color for this brightness bar and that is what we are going to see in this video. In case if you are new on the channel, make sure you subscribe and be a part of Apex community to watch crisp and short contents on the Galaxy phones, Android applications, One UI, etc. And if you like this video, make sure to smash that like button as well. Now to customize the theme on Samsung phones, we can either do it by going to settings, we can go to color palette uh, that is under wallpaper and style. Here we have got color palette option. We get these predetermined colors, color combinations uh, by the AI. Uh, we get about four options here. We can set one of them here. So the brightness bar will get one of these colors which are shown here. But now if you want to specifically customize the brightness bar, we can only do it on the GoodLock application. Now setting the color particularly on the brightness bar is a bit tricky. Uh, though it is simple, uh, you need to do something on the uh, theme park module which I'm going to show you here. Now what we will do is, let me open GoodLock module here. Now to customize the brightness bar, we have to go to the notification panel or the quick panel customization. So that can be done either on the quick star module where we can customize the quick panel. As you can see here, we have style your own quick panel. Uh, this allows us to uh, theme the quick panel here. Let's go back. We can do this theming even on the theme park engine that we all know already. Let me open theme park here. As you can see at the bottom, we have got quick panel customization option. Now let me tap on create. As you can see, we can customize each and every sections of the quick panel over here, but there is no brightness bar shown over here. So we don't have a specific color setting option for the brightness bar over here. As you can see, there is no brightness bar shown also over here. Now, uh, I'm sure I don't have to tell you about how we can customize all these sections. So we've got all these rings here and uh, they are pointing towards a particular section of the notification panel or the quick panel. Uh, we can change the colors for them. So I have made separate videos on that. You can go ahead and check the channel. Now what we are going to discuss here is only application of the colors on the brightness bar. Now for that what we need to do is we need to first set the base color. As you can see here we have an option here called color. We have to tap on this. Here we have to set the base color. Let's say uh, I will uh, reduce the transparency. I'll increase the transparency here and I'll set red. I'll tap on OK. Now this is the base color which will be applied even on the brightness bar. This is something which is really important. You have to set the base color first. Now after setting the base color, now let's say I have set red here. Uh, we have got the same red and black combo here. I'll tap on this. This will apply red color on the brightness bar. Now let's go ahead and download this theme. I'm not going to customize any of these, so you can do it on your own. Uh, like I said, you know, it's only for the brightness bar. So let me just download this theme now. I'll just name it. Okay. As you can see, we already have this new theme here for the quick panel. I'll select this and apply this. Now let's open the quick panel. As you can see, the quick panel has the red brightness bar. Now what we'll do is we will go back and change the brightness bar color again. Let's tap on edit. Now the base color here is red. I will change this to let's say blue. I'll tap on OK. Now automatically it is selected blue and dark combo. Uh, let's leave it as it is. Now let me tap on download. I will install this theme. All right, now it's installed. Let me select or apply this particular notification panel theme. Now let's see the brightness bar. As you can see, the brightness bar is in blue. This is how we can specifically customize the brightness bar color. All you need to do is just set the base color right. You just tap on this particular color option here, select the color you want, the same, and then you will go back to the color combos here and the same color will be applied for the brightness bar. That's all you need to do. And then of course you can change all these uh, background blur, 
and uh, the colors for all these sections here you can select them and you can customize the way you want i have demonstrated this in many of my previous videos on good Lock application or theme park modules you can go ahead and check them out in the description right all right that's all i want to share with you guys i hope this video was useful for some of you guys who have been wondering how to customize or set a particular color on your brightness bar do go ahead and customize it on the theme park and by the way if you like this wallpaper the link is in the description you can check that out and i hope you have already subscribed to the channel if you haven't done it yet go ahead and subscribe and leave a like for this video as well thanks all for watching you guys take care and stay safe i will see you in the next one cheers bye bye like